Hey guys, it is Xy here and today we are going to be playing Five Nights at Freddy's Combat Another once again, bro. This is episode 10. Man, we are so far into this series, man. I really, really do appreciate all the support that you guys have been leaving for this series. But uh, yeah, let's go on and get right into it. So today I'm pretty sure I have like a normal mode fight at first, and then after that, you know, we can get to the other ones. But, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it, man. Chapter 3, let's go ahead and see who my opponent is. Oh, yeah, yeah, I completely forgot. So, we do have the endoskeleton, which is on normal mode, so it should be very, very easy. But, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do that one first, obviously. Let's go. Okay, okay, so I'm playing as the puppet, man. I, I think... Okay, then, so I'm actually playing as the puppet, and to be honest with you, man, it has been a pretty long time since I've actually played with the puppet in this game, but let's go ahead and do this, man, and though you are, you gotta be ready, man, because my puppet attacks are absolutely insane, and it's definitely, you know, um, just like the Nightmare Own, basically, we have the same, like, skill set and everything. The only real difference is uh, I don't do as much damage as, you know, Nightmare Own, obviously. Um, and by the way, that's probably the, you know, best animatronic that I've, that I've actually uh, played with so far. But for some reason, why is the endoskeleton doing all that damage, man? Look at my health. Look at the puppet's health. That's insane. Okay, let me go on and, uh, let me go on and teach you a lesson, Endo. Come on now. Come on now, you gotta go ahead and get hit by some of these, you know, twirling attacks. Oh my god, his control does so much damage. Okay, so the puppet, the puppet honestly seems just as weak as Toy Bonnie, if we're being completely real here, man. Because the fact that I'm losing right now, or like anywhere near losing, I don't think I'm losing at this point. But uh, the fact that I was at all is insane, because this is the endoskeleton, man. Oh my god, are you leaving the map? He is literally leaving the map, man. Okay, yeah, go ahead and just run away from me. You can go ahead and do that because, you know, my twirling attack is really like that, all right? Let me go ahead and use my control. There we go. Man, I love using my control. Oh, but he just did his. Oh, my God. This is actually a lot closer than I thought it was going to be, but he just left the map. Oh, my God. He literally just left the map. What am I supposed to do, man? Are you serious? Okay, then I guess I have to literally restart the game now. Jeez, okay. Approximately 10 hours later. Okay, guys. So I literally had to literally... And I, I just said literally a lot. But uh, yeah, I just had to restart the entire fight, man. That's crazy. I hate how they're just able to leave the map like that. Like that literally... Oh my god. Can I please say or stop saying literally? Jeez. But, uh, yeah, I just really don't like the fact that, you know, he can just leave the map like that. And then the AI, you know, just completely leaves the fight because then I have to completely restart. But, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do this, man. Okay, now I kind of know, you know, his attacks a little bit. It seems like he's pretty powerful when he actually, you know, gets to do that little, uh, I don't even know what to call that, like stretching, um, skill set. So, yeah, it seems like he's pretty powerful when he actually gets to do that. So, I kind of have to, you know, chip away in his health because I can't just go all in and expect for myself to win. You know what I mean? I got to actually, you know, take it slow, easily, um, you know, take him down. Okay, hold up, hold up. You are getting way too close, man. Okay. Oh, I completely forgot about my control. There we go. Um, but yeah, his health is a lot lower than mine at this point. Well, I won't say a lot lower. Um, I just did, but you know what I mean, like, it's not that much lower, but at the same time, you know, I do feel a lot safer than I did last time, even though he's literally about to get his control off, and it's not gonna be good, yep, okay then, you, you wanna be like that, Endo, you wanna be like that, Endo, okay, let me see, let me see, uh, let me see as soon as I get my control, there we go, okay, so he's lower than 50%, I'm probably sitting at exactly 50%, so definitely pretty good right now. I definitely have to escape him though, we don't want to be literally right next to him, man. 
And by the way, my health right now, I don't know what just happened to it. I'm telling you, bro, as soon as you get right next to the endo, it does so, so much more damage than it would have if I was just, you know, chipping away at him. So we're going to go and try to chip him away like we were at the beginning. And I think that's a much better strategy than, you know, what we did at the middle of the fight right there. But yeah, this is a lot better. Let me go ahead and move back a little bit. You know, we just got to go ahead and chip away from his health. Just, you know, small bits by small bits and by the way we're both about to get to our controls so as far as that we are like kind of tied so i'm not really you know too worried about that okay let's go and do it yep we did it okay he's about to get to it though okay we definitely have to escape this man we do not want to be in the middle of crossfire okay what are you doing man leave me alone leave me alone okay honestly man if i can actually get to my control before he does I truthfully think that I can beat him. So that's the goal right now. We got to go ahead and get to our control before he does. And hopefully, just hopefully, we're able to actually, you know, annihilate him. Unless he actually gets his control off as well. Because if he does end up doing that, then we are kind of screwed, to be honest with you. I cannot let him actually get to his control, all right? Come on, let's go ahead and do this. That was a great possession. Okay, okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Puppet, yes! I got to him before he actually got to his attack, man. Let's go on and do this. Okay, so we have Nightmare Fredbear on hard mode once again. And I clearly remember actually playing against him, man. So this is actually going to be pretty hard. I'm pretty sure that he's like one of the best animatronics in the game. But uh, yeah, let's go on and check it out. Oh my god, I'm actually playing as Nightmare. I don't actually think I've ever played as Nightmare, have I? And if I did, it's probably only been like one other time. But yeah, this is pretty cool. Like, I've literally played as the puppet in Nightmare. Man, if only I got to play as all the Nightmare animatronics. Like, I had to fight them at one point in, what, like, Chapter 2. So yeah, that was, that was absolutely insane. But I gotta... Oh my god, I'm actually doing a lot of damage. Look at that. Oh my god, and he's on hard mode too. Man, Nightmare is absolutely insane. Look at how he's just chunking away at him, bro. Nightmare is ruthless. Look at his health. That's crazy. Okay, then. I like it, bro. I really, really like it. And look how fast he gets this control as well. Oh, my God. We are unstoppable as Nightmare, bro. This is crazy. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and defeat him, man, because this is way too easy at this point. Look at how powerful I am, man. He does not even stand a chance against his brother Nightmare, man. Nightmare Fredbear, you gotta go in and get your weight up, man. Because you are nowhere near as powerful as your brother, man. Jeez. I'm like the older brother that just, you know, takes advantage of his little brother Nightmare Fredbear, man. Because this is just unfair at this point. Like, what are you even doing? What are you even fighting me for? You know what I mean? Like, you were just screwed at this point, man. Let me go in and get, my, get to my control, and then I think it's pretty much over. It is pretty much over, bro. Let me go in and just chunk you away for this last little uh, bar of health. And as you guys have been, you know, watching, I literally have not had any strategy to this whatsoever. I'm literally just fighting and chipping away at his health. Literally just, you know, up front too. I'm not, you know, you know, slowly doing it or anything. I'm just taking his life away just like that, man. And as you can see, we won. This has actually been a very, very successful episode, man. So now, now we have Freddy on normal mode. That is actually... Uh, I'm guessing pretty easy, right? Like, it's just Freddy. I mean, how hard could that be? You know what I mean? So, yeah, let's go ahead and do it, man. Very, very excited to go up against Freddy. Who am I going with, though? That's the real question. Oh, my God. Don't do this to me. We're playing as Endo against Freddy? Okay, I'm not going to lie. I feel like Freddy is, like, low-key very powerful, and nobody really just knows it. You know what I mean? So, I mean, I will try to beat him, but at the same time, I don't know if I'll be able to, okay? Okay, I, I like the Endo's um, attack, though. The one problem that I do have with it is that he just kind of stays there, like, as soon as I do it. I can't actually move back or anything, like, while I'm attacking, which is kind of a problem. Um, hopefully we're able to, you know, address that later on, but so far so good, you know what I mean? He's definitely one of the fastest animatronics, and as you can see, 
we are much much uh shorter than freddy so we're able to just you know get by him a lot faster as well it kind of feels like i'm playing with foxy a little bit to be honest with you but yeah this is going absolutely great freddy you gotta go ahead and just ease up man because i am on a roll i don't think i've ever won all three three of my fights without any losses in this game so far except for maybe like the very start you know what i mean because i definitely got a lot of w's back then but just you know as soon as it started getting a lot harder i don't think i've actually won three games in a row and if i'm able to actually do this man then it is definitely going to be a pretty cool accomplishment for episode 10 man episode 10 i really want to go in and do this man three w's on part 10 that would definitely be pretty nice all right let's go ahead and do it man i gotta go ahead and you know stop talking and actually do it man because you know you can talk all you want but at the end of the day you gotta go out and do it okay hold up i'm about to get to my control again oh yeah he he does not stand a chance man look at how much health i have compared to him yeah you are definitely a goner at this point freddy like i don't even know what to say to you you are just completely off the rails done bro because i am a lot better than you i'm i'm just gonna you know keep it true man i am a lot better than you that's crazy i have never played three back-to-back -back games where i've won w's like this man this this actually feels really good you know not losing it feels great it feels great but it does feel like i'm kind of missing something so we're gonna go and have to see who our next opponent is for sure but uh you're about to get to your control man but at the end of the day it does not matter okay because i'm about to end you no matter what and uh yes sir let's get it man you win i love to see that screen every single time all right man so we're actually playing against foxy on hard mode i have never ever done this i'm gonna go ahead and, ha and I'm gonna go ahead and you know give you guys my best attempt i really don't know if i'm gonna be able to actually beat him whatsoever but you know we're gonna give you my best attempt as i said so uh yeah let me see what i'm playing with oh okay plush trap against foxy this is like the short animatronics fight man because plush trap is super short and foxy is pretty short as well all right but uh oh my god look at how plush trap moves i like that attack man he just he does like a jumping chunk away oh my god he foxy can literally move you know through pretty much anything like did you see how he just went up yeah i feel like he's about to leave the fight for some reason man which is which is not great to say the least but uh one thing that i really like as well is you guys can clearly tell that my control bar goes a lot slower and so does his like ours is a lot um it builds up a lot slower than you know the other ones um such as like nightmare who just built it up like super super fast but so far so good man foxy has really no recipe for us like we are just completely destroying him at this point and uh, the thing about these small animatronics is that they're really not like heavy whatsoever so they can't really take a whole bunch of damage they kind of just you know you know they just kind of run away from the scene a little bit to be honest with you like they don't have the the power to just stay there and completely fight all the time so that's what you're really seeing with foxy he's kind of like moving away from the scene and things like that so plush trap is really just able to you know take advantage of that to be honest with you like he really has no recipe for us like i said but yeah man you gotta go ahead and just give it up bro because plush trap is not playing around and i honestly think that i'm about to beat four animatronics in one video this feels great man i have not had a single animatronic to really challenge me thus far but it's kind of crazy though because like oh my god please don't move away from the map please please stay in the map because if you move away from the map at this point then i gotta go in and restart everything man please don't do that to me please foxy you gotta go in and just chill out man oh he's about to get his, to his control uh but it's way too late man because i am clearly about to win i just gotta go in and get to my control and then you are done for foxy yeah let me go in and get to my control there we go man yeah you are completely done for foxy you have no hope at this point man small animatronics plush trap comes up on top let me go in and actually finish him off though come on now come on now foxy just stay in one spot man just stay in one spot and take your beating 
Oh, yes. We got it. You won. You won, man. Let's go ahead and do this. Four W's in a single video. When have I ever done that? Because I'm quite sure that I've never done that before. But anyways, man, we are going up against Nightmare Yone in the next video. Make sure you go ahead and leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it. And if you want to see the next part up as soon as possible, man. But other than that, also subscribe to the channel as well. That is greatly appreciated if you haven't done so already. And uh, comment down below any game suggestions or feedback for the video as well. And with all of that being said, man, I want to see all of you guys in the next video. And peace and love to everybody out there.